and time is getting short. We are running out of time, people of God. Please, we are asking you today, may you hear the word of the Lord. That is why I said until my last breath, I want to declare and warn the people. The Lord has said that I am a voice. He has made me to be a voice even in the wilderness, in the place of desolation, in a place where people are sitting in darkness to let you know that there is a day of reckoning. The Lord is coming back. The day of judgment is coming. There is a day when you will not be able to beg God. You will not be able to give an excuse and say, Lord, I didn't know. You will not be able to say, Lord, I was too young. I was too old. I was too busy. I had, to, I had, I had, I had children. I had a busy, I was busy with my affairs, with my businesses. Occupied with my opinions. There is a day that is coming and the Lord has sent me as a, a voice. As many voices he's sending to the world to speak. And I want to let you know today that I'm calling to you and say, please do not turn back. Do not shut off this, record, this video as you are listening. Do not turn it off, but listen and may the Lord bless you. We are coming before we say, Lord, speak to us tonight. May your word edify, instruct, for we know that every scripture in the word is good for correction, for edification, for instruction. Your word is available for discipline, to correct, to discipline us, to instruct us, to reshape us. Hallelujah. We come and we sit at the feet of your word. We say, Father, today speak to us a word in season. Even out of season, I will speak in the name of Jesus that you may know because I know that there is a day that there will not be anyone to warn you again. There is a day that my voice will not be able to warn you. I will not be able to catch you out of the flames. There is a word that was spoken to me as a young lady. I was told, God has given you the grace to, for the people of Congo. And I want to speak to the people of Congo. For the Lord has told me that I have given you the power to snatch them from the pit of hell. To snatch them from the flames of hell. And I'm calling, I'm, I'm calling to you, my Congolese brothers, American brothers, I'm calling you out of darkness in the name of Jesus. God is waiting for you. The Lord is waiting. The Father is waiting. And he says, come back. If you have left the ways of the Lord, if you have turned you away from God, it is time to return. There is a time to return. You can come back to your senses like the prodigal son. He woke up and he realized, ever since I left my father, my life is not better. I've lost everything I have. I'm no better. Are you better now that you left Christianity? Are you better now that you've left Jesus Christ? Is your life any better? No, it is not. We are calling you now. Come back to the Lord Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I want to say God bless you. We are going to go into the next page into the Bible study. 